embedded C. In this video, we will understand the bit timing of CAN protocol. This is the fifth video of our CAN protocol tutorials. If you haven't watched our previous videos, there is a link available in the description. Also, a card will appear here. We recommend you to watch this video before going to this. Let's move to this video. First, we will start with what is the bit time. Bit time is a time taken to transmit a single bit. We will take our own CAN frame for this. We know CAN frame is made up of multiple bits. So, the time taken to transmit a single bit like this is the bit time. Calculating bit time. Bit time that is T bit can be calculated by 1 by CAN bus speed. Here the bus rate defines the time for each bit. So bit time is equal to can the speed. Let's take an example for calculating the bit time. If the CAN bus rate is 1 megabit per second, then what is the bit time? So bit time is equal to 1 by 1 0 0 0 0 0 0 that is 0 point zero 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 one that is one microsecond. If the CAN bus rate is five hundred kilobits per second, then what is the bit time? You can post this answer in the comments. Let's see bit time segments. Bit time is made up of different segments that is sync segment, propagation segment and phase buffer segment 1 and phase buffer segment 2. So, one bit has, bit time has four different segments. Let's move to time quantum. Time quantum is a fixed unit of time derived from the oscillator period. Each bit timing segment is made up of integer units of time called time quantum, that is TQ. This is how the different segment is made up of time quantum. Here, segment is made up of one time quantum, and the other segments are made up of four. And two to time quantums. So this is how time quantum constructs the segment. So here we can see sync segment can vary one to one twenty eight time quanta and propagation and phase segment can vary one to one twenty five time quanta. Phase segment 2 can vary from 1 to 1 to 8 and quantum. The time quantum TQ is time can be configured to different times. Bit time can range from 4 to 385 time quantums. The 
the range varies for each microcontroller. Calculating the time corner. Length of one time quantum can be calculated by bond rate prescaler that is VRP divided by system drop F6. So this is the end of our video. Thanks for watching this video. If you have any queries or suggestion, please post it in the comments. If you really like this video, please hit the like button. If you want to get more updates or more videos like this, please subscribe to our channel.